Hey friends, this is Erica with Miley Scraps. I hope you're having a great day. I'm back today with a Bible journaling process video. I hope you enjoy it. Let's get started. So today we are journaling in Psalms 139 verses 13 through 17. My New Living Translation Bible says, You made all the delicate inner parts of my body. You knit me together in my mother's womb. Thank you for making me so wonderfully complex. Your workmanship is marvelous. How well I know it. You watched me as I was being formed in utter seclusion, as I was woven together in the dark of the womb. You saw me before I was born. Every day of my life was recorded in your book. Every moment was laid out before a single day had passed. How precious are your thoughts of me, O God, they cannot be numbered. And my journaling Bible says this, his thoughts concerning me are amazing. I just love that. And as I was studying this evening, I looked up and, and ran across the Hebrew translations for fearfully and wonderfully, and I really enjoyed this as well. Fearfully, when translated from the Hebrew language, means great reverence, heartfelt interest, and with respect. And wonderfully, when translated from the Hebrew language, means unique and set apart. So from a creative standpoint, I chose to start with the word enough as that being my focal point. And basically what I did was go to Google and type in the word enough in scripty font. And I found what I liked and I printed it off so that I could trace it. And fortunately, I don't have the talent to do it freehand. So this was definitely the next best thing. So I'm definitely fairly new at Bible journaling, but I'm loving it. And I'm loving that I'm getting in the word and being able to be creative at the same time. But what I was showing you there a few seconds ago was that I had used a Sharpie marker and it definitely bled through. So I'll have to figure out how to cover that up if I journal on that page. So a big shout out to Illustrated Faith. I just absolutely love their content and I love their printables. And this one I actually bought from them for my daughter for her journaling Bible. And we actually did journal in her Bible last night. And I, I'm gonna post a picture of that at the end. But I want her to know that she is beautiful and that she is strong and that she is you know, wonderfully, fearfully made, that she's made in his image. And so that's something that I'm really trying to get her to see. And I would love for her to see herself through his eyes and to see herself through my eyes. So these printables were perfect. I wanted to take a moment to share something personal about myself. So I have struggled with anxiety and fear and worry. And I was just thinking about this. Look at that. I am strong enough. I am very, very thankful that I am strong enough that with him by my side, I can conquer anything. And I hope that that's an encouragement to anyone else that might struggle with these things as well.
guys. So I'm actually still getting used to videoing myself when I'm crafting or Bible journaling. And I was actually out of frame. I'm gonna have to learn to remember that I have to check that. Sorry guys. Well guys, this page is just almost done. I wanted to take a minute to explain to you why I chose the word enough as my focal point for this page. So sometimes I think that we all have moments to where we think that we're not enough, but we need to remember what the word tells us, what he tells us. He says that we are fearfully and wonderfully made. And in my daughter's Bible, it says we should have as much respect for ourselves as our maker has for us. I was also looking online and came across a site that says, who does God say that I am? And I loved this. It says, I'm a child of God. It says, I have been accepted by Christ. I have been made complete in Christ. And God loves me and has chosen me. Well, guys, I hope that this has encouraged you and I hope that you've enjoyed the video. I've posted some pictures here of the final product and I've also posted some pictures of my daughter's page with this verse as well. I hope you'll consider liking and subscribing. Have a great day. Bye.